Apart from that, uh, Nyeri residents are today expected to turn out in large numbers for the commemoration of freedom fighter Field Marshal Didan Kimathi. The event by the county government of Obnyeri in collaboration with the Didan Kimathi Foundation is being held at Karuna Ini, the spot where Kimathi is believed to have been shot and captured by the colonizers. Our reporter Ibrahim Karanja is covering this for us and now joins us live for an update. Ibrahim, a walk down memory lane for Kenyans in Nyeri County. What more can you tell us? Well, indeed, Michelle, it's a walk down memory lane for Kenyans, uh, residents of Erie County, and the entire republic. Remember, on this date, in 1957, Field Marshal Dedan Kimathi died, and today is his comm commemoration after he died. And Erie County government, in conjunction with the Dedan Kimathi Foundation, has decided to honor him in a very unique way by erecting a monument in his honor here in Karunaine, the spot where Field Marshal Dedan Kimathi is believed to have been shot and captured uh, back then before he was taken to committee maximum prison and before actually now he's hanging that came later on in 1957. At, at least 10 counties have been uh, represented here with descendants of other freedom fighters, descendants of Dedan Kimathi, descendants of Mekatilili Wamenza, descendants of Koitalel Arab Samoe are all converging here in Yeri to honor this freedom fighter. And I want to engage the governor for Yeri County, His Excellency Mutahi Kahiga, perhaps to break down the number of visitors who are here. And there has been that of concern amongst descendants of Mau Mau fighters in terms of recognition. We want to engage from the governor, uh, to get to hear from the governor perhaps what sort of, or what levels of uh, involvement this kind of people, these descendants of Mau Mau fighters have been having. Thank you so much, governor. You are live on KTN. Thank you for uh, agreeing to speak to us despite uh, the function being on. Can you tell us, over 20, at least 20 counties being represented, perhaps tell us the, the, the uh, guests that we have today. Yeah, thank you very much. Today is the 18th of February, the year 2020. It is 63 years since... Uh, uh, Field Marshal Dedan Kemadi was hanged. He was hanged like a common criminal, yet he was a freedom fighter. He has never been accorded what we believe in should be a, a, a very uh, honorable barrier. It is unfortunate that this one has not happened. We continue to insist that the, his body must be found and for us to bury him. Whatever remains of him, we will be able to bury him. But I want to say, I want to appreciate that, that we now have uh, the Dendan Kimathi Foundation working with us, with the national museums and national government, to commemorate this day. We are doing this so that the spirit of Kimathi can continue being and hovering within ourselves. And we must recognize Kimathi and his family as a family that dedicated themselves for the love of this country. And so one of the things we can continue to say is that we thank the president because he has sent, we have our representatives from the national government. We are still longing for him to come and, 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 and really inaugurate this uh, monument and statue that we have done for Den and Kemadi because we know that him and his father were also part of this struggle. Well, Governor, uh, before I allow you to go back to the podium, just a brief question in terms of recognition of descendants of the Mau Mau fighters, especially in Nyeri. Nyeri was the center for liberation of this country. Perhaps how far are we as the county government? Perhaps is it something that uh, falls under the county government? Yeah. So thank you very much. Yes, Nyeri was uh, was actually the battlefield. The Abadeas and Mount Kenya and our people really went out there to fight. Many of us have uh, relatives who, got law, who died in the forest as they fought for this. But it's sad that uh, Nyeri also, I think, is leading in number of colonial villages because we have uh, close to around 35. Uh, we thank the president that uh, working with the national government, we have been able to provide uh, title deeds to those people that fought. But all we can say is that uh, I think it's time for us to recognize these people, their children, their descendants. Some of them are walking around with bullets in their body. And I think we need uh, as a people to recognize this. And I would make an appeal right here to the president this year, there will be there, there will be medals given to during Jamhuri Day. Why isn't Mukambi Kimadi given a medal in honor for what she did and her family? Because really, I think she deserves that. The least we can do. Thank you. Thank you so much, Governor. Thank you. Well, Michelle, that is Governor Mutai Kaiga. Of course, his name has been called at the podium. Uh, he has to address, but a number of delegates are here, including the uh, Deputy Governor Nandi County, including representative of uh, the Governor. 
governor of Nyandarua, Francis Kememia, and other delegates, and thousands of residents who have turned up from several counties. So this is a function that we keep our eye on, uh, even as we later on talk to the people of Nyeri to understand perhaps what importance, what uh, the weight at which they hold such a function. But as of now, Michelle, I bring it back to you in studio. Reporter Ibrahim Karanja live for us.